What's up, everybody? This is Mel for the Pizza Boy, and welcome back to Madden 20, face of the franchise. Last time, we lost to the Green Bay Packers, but this week, we can do some redemption and get a win, or try to get a win over the Houston Texans. Let's get straight into it. Hey, everybody, it's the coach. This is Madden 20 on EA Sports. Up next, we've got what ought to be a great matchup between the Oakland Raiders and the Houston Texans. I'll be back with you again with scores around the league at halftime. But kickoff right around the corner. And standing by to call the action, here are Brandon Godden and Charles Davis. Okay, Coach, on a wonderful fall afternoon in the state of Texas, the roof is open and we've got football from NRG Stadium in Houston. They do it big here in Houston, and a second ago, it was a Texas-sized welcome for their hometown guys. They're fired up and ready to go as they get set to match up with the Oakland Raiders. Hi again, everyone, with Charles Davis. I'm Brandon Gordon, and Charles, we look at this Texan ball club entering play here. They come in losers of two straight, so they're trying to right the ship here a little bit. They're teetering a little bit, aren't they? And now things could really go south if they lose this game, so they understand the importance of playing well and stopping this streak. On the other side of the field for the visiting Raiders, they come in off their very first loss of the year, suffered a week ago. Yeah, it will not be a perfect season, but I'm interested to see how they bounce back now that they know that chasing the 1972 Dolphins is out the window. Okay, right, we're going to start off the game with the ball first. I know, I know, uh, wanted, last time he wanted more, uh, more time with the ball. So now the first carry for ball. Doug Martin. And he'll lose yardage. Brought down at the 32. And Doug, it's a loss of a yard right there and it's second ball. down. All right, quick observation, Brandon, because early on in this game, I'm seeing linebackers playing their noses close to the line of scrimmage. And my guess is the wheels are turning on that other sideline. As a play car, you're filing that away right now, aren't you? Yeah, you're trying to find that opportunity later on when you can play action <laughs> oh my God, or gonna, stick my something guy. to them between the <laughs> second and the third level. Playing. Give them 14 on that one and a first down. And this is why trying to cover the angle route is so difficult. Anyone playing the linebacker position, when they see a running back out of the backfield widen because he heads towards the flat first, oftentimes oh, no, you widen it. too much and overcommit. He cuts up inside. That is right and this is what we saw there. A nice pickup for a first down. Jesus. Here we go. Here we go. 50, 60, I wonder how injury is this one play. Lewis now. To throw on second down, eluding the pressure right. The pass complete to Ryan Grant. Oh, that catch good, good for five. Though. It's third down. He was out there waving his arms, I and mean, when you got a quarterback out of the pocket looking for any help, I guess waving the arms is helpful. It certainly is because you got to get his attention because now you're in scramble drill. So everyone's adjusting their routes, finding open space, and he found the right spot for the completion. And he's going to be taken down with another first down as the stop's made at the Texans 39. That's something you have to be aware of as a defense and have to find a way to account for him. And if you're not going to use a spy, you're telling your guys to keep your eyes on him because when he breaks out and makes plays like that, all he does is hurt you. Have to at least be able to contain him somewhat. There they could not. And he's going to be they, out down inside the 20. No one can be painting whenever Big I get out of the there on the scramble. It gets him that's a first down. Noticed. Containing him is becoming a big problem. We've already seen this once earlier on this drive. Yeah, and so now two times this has happened. Do you adjust something? Yeah, I think you do. I think you have something about your rush lanes. Try not to either. And this is caught. There we go. Touchdown, Raiders. Ryan Grant, his first touchdown on the year. And they are able to strike first here on their opening drive. Hmm. I thought it was An ideal start for them, really. The you force the punt, and then you go down and score. And you've got to see a fist pump on the sideline from oh, the head coach, don't you? Because he's turned into his first. bench, and he's telling his team, hmm. this is how we prepare. Force the punt, go downfield and score. I told you guys, it's just like a boxer in the gym preparing for the fight. Now we get to turn it all loose. Okay. On the 
Oh, Martin, you're back. On first and ten, Lewis. It's complete, Doug Martin. Oh, God, you're doing good. And down he goes, but he takes it up to the 40. Now, he may want to go back to that one. First play of the drive, good for 15 and a first down. And this will probably be the last play of the quarter. First down, here's the run with Martin. And he's going to be brought down on what will be the final Martin, play come of on. this first quarter. These two teams all tied after one. The last run got three. Now here's second and seven. Oh, dang it. This, this play doesn't have more. Throwing is Lewis. Escaping the pressure right. Throwing right, and that's complete. A gain of three last play. This time they double it and pick up six. And the Texans have an extra defender in the secondary now on third down. Here's Lewis. Operating from the gun. Oh, no. He's going to have to eat this one as down he goes. J.J. Watt. Oh, we got to get a quick score. Now Lewis. Off the play fake. He's going deep for Brown. And that is going to be okay. one-handed. Wow. Personal foul. Face mask. Defense. Um, Tack on 15 more for the face mask, and that becomes a huge glass. Big pass gets caught on you. You're doing Can somebody tell me what happened there? On the ground, I don't even know. I just you do it. The face mask. <laughs> now Lewis, flushed out right. That is caught. And Antonio Brown's in the end zone. And he'll take it into the end zone for a Raider touchdown. Antonio Brown. His fifth touchdown now on the year. That first play of the drive, I don't even know what happened. Tying this football game. All the receivers in the league are... <laughs> Lewis, throwing on first down, eluding the pressure right. Caught right side, Gresham. And he'll get this one They're down near the 20-yard line, just shy of the 20. It's a gain of 34. First down now, but that clock rolling. Back to throw. Lewis. It's a screen to Richard. Oh, Richard. And he doesn't quite oh. make it, taking it with it an eyelash. Dropped at the one. Great gains back to back. Last time over 30 yards, better than 20 here. Martin. Goal line offense, something they've really been emphasizing in practice late. That he's there we go, Martin. And in for That's a great touchdown. End of the half Doug situation. Martin with touchdown number seven on the year. And the Raiders have taken the lead. I can't believe I'm going perfect just right one now. sentence for that one. Clinic. And that's what they've done. They lead the league in points per game this season, but it's been quick strike ability as we saw on that drive. I think they're actually intimidating defenses because they're back on their heels right away, wondering. Hey, Martin. Let's go now, let's go now, let's go now. 16 out Ready, ready, ready. They'll indeed try to run it out as they start on the ground. And he'll just push his way forward for a few as the clock will run. The tackle that time by Zach Cunningham. Here's second and eight. They'll roll him out right. And he'll be out of bounds at the 25-yard line. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> the Texans here on third down, putting an extra defender in the secondary. Mm. Looking to throw, Lewis, and he takes a shot on the release as this will be incomplete. First incomplete pass, too. That's bad. But this is the second half now. To throw is Lewis on first and ten. And his throw is going to be incomplete. Antonio Brown, the intended receiver. And that will bring up second down. Once again, they'll come up on the 26-yard line, second and 10. 
Lewis now. Going to throw again. He's going deep for Brown. And he almost oh, had him defensively. Could have been a game changer there in this second <laughs> half. Instead, it's third down. Big play coming up. Here's third and ten. Down I would expect to see some pressure here. And the blitz does come. Rolling to his left. That's incomplete, but there is a flag down. So hang on. A big call coming on third down. Hey, that's going to be the kind. They saved my ass. On the ground, Richard. Oh, the score is going to pass the 30 before he's hit and dropped. <laughs> nice way to start the drive, a gain of 12 and a first down. Pardon if you want more carries. I think we saw how you get him. Showed that he's got the fresh legs, and he picked up the first down on that run. Don't just ask for him. Show him that you're supposed to get the football. Here's a throw out wide complete to his running back right side. I don't know what he's doing. Here, going down back at the 28. That'll set him back with a loss of three on the play. And it'll bring up a second and 13. Really good defensive effort. They were all over there. Again. Swing pass out to the right side before I lost want, yard. I don't want to I want to better execution and done with a lot of enthusiasm, wasn't it? Absolutely. They saw it all the way, ran to the football, and caused a nice play for lost yardage. <laughs> Well, apart from Connor Murray, not too many mobile QBs in this year's rookie class, but some good scrambling really? there to get the first. On first down, it's Martin. And that play will go nowhere. Losing yardage back near midfield at the 49. It'll be a loss of one. And that will bring up a second and 11. Here's Lewis, looking to throw on second down. Oh. Escaping the pressure right. They'll tussle for it, and this is going to be caught. Oh, and thank he's going to be taken down with another first down as the Great stop's time. made at the Texans' 23. And the young know, Bucks showing that ability and agility to dance um, outside of the pocket and complete the deep ball. I don't um, think for a second that the coaches have to have their heart rate accelerate a little bit. The only one I can't trust is they say it's hard. I give him opportunity. You're just hoping that they make good decisions and he doesn't do anything Because so many things can happen that can go wrong when you throw it downfield like that. He got away with it there and in a big way. They run it again with Martin. And they see right through that Ooh. defensively. As he'll be hit and taken down to the backfield. They'll wind up losing three yards here. And it'll be third and ten. Now Lewis to throw on third down. Forced out to his left. He can run for it and he will. And he nearly got the first himself. But it, it appears he's going to be about a yard. Okay. This is one thing I hate. Why don't they pick the field goal instead of like going for it? Lewis on first down. Buying time to his left. The drive starting with a first down like, 11 yards I'm, on that pickup. I can get into good field position. How many times have we seen this late in the fourth just, quarter? Because you know the pass rush is getting after them. The computer is stimulated after get the fourth great down. Push. And what do they create? They sometimes Space, don't want to go for the field goal. I don't know why. On first down, Lewis, flush to his right. Throw right side, complete to Williams. Five yards on the catch there, brings up second down. Like Antonio Brown, Tyrell Williams came to the Raiders in March. Came up the coast from L.A. where he caught 41 balls last year with the Chargers. His best year was 2016 when the Chargers were still in San Diego. Over 1,000 yards, 7 touchdowns, and the Raiders really have high hopes for this 27-year-old receiver. Six yards to pick up, and that's a first down. So signs of life in what's been a dormant offense in this second half. Here's first and ten. Back to throw, Lewis. And that'll be good for eight yards to the 45. And that was not a bad scramble there on first down. He didn't force it, nor did he throw it away. He was able to take off, and now he made it a very manageable second and short. Rolling to his right. He's got a first down and no inside the 30. 
And down to the 27 yard line. All right, partner, I'm a defender, but I've got to express my admiration there. Moving around, making it happen, and instead of worrying about protecting himself, he goes and gets the first down. I've got to give it to him on that one. Normally, you don't want your guy taking shots, your oh. quarterback, but it's winning time here in the fourth quarter. If he needs to make those plays with the legs, go ahead, right? Yeah, no doubt about it. It's, at this stage of the game, all protections, they're off. To throw is Lewis. Throwing again on second and ten. Time finally oh. runs out. He can't get rid of the football, and he's taken down. I don't think that was a blitz, was it? No, not at all. I mean, there was no blitz called on the play. Had other responsibilities, but he saw an opportunity, him. saw a path, and he took it. Now on third and long, they'll look to throw. Oh, oh. It's caught. Oh, Nelson. Thank God. They're able to convert thank on God third down, and that sets up a first and goal. Well, we haven't been shortchanged on offense. Another fun play to watch there on the deep pass. This game has the feel of, what, a, a turkey bowl, a Thanksgiving day. You know, when we get together this year and the Davises and the Bodens get oh, together, man, that's what our playbook's going to look like. Like they're drawing them up in the dirt, and so far it's working for both of them. Some things I just don't... So it's Raider football but as we get your reset. Does. They've got it second and goal as they look to grab a late lead. They'll run for it with Martin. There we go, Martin. That's what we needed. Touchdown, we needed this touchdown. Doug Martin, his second touchdown of the afternoon. Do and they're able to break the tie and move out in front here in this fourth quarter. Hey, that score deserves our respect, deserves our excitement. But I'm looking at the clock, and I'm thinking, there's a long way to go in this one. Ideally, mm -hmm. they would have liked to milk a little bit more time off. Now on the other sideline, you start to get the crew together and say, this is what we practiced the two-minute drill for, right? Yeah, you hope you've been in that situation before, and if you have... Okay. On the top. We need to get some points. Lewis now throwing on first down, being chased out left. He's got a first down past the 30. That's a good way to start the drive. Down, 17 yards timeout. and a first That's down. We always the Raiders got to use one of their timeouts as the clock will stop with 18 seconds remaining. So from the 36 now, first and 10. Here's Lewis from the gun. He'll throw. Brought in over the middle by Grant. And they're going to have this across <laughs> midfield and inside the 45. Now the Raiders going to go ahead and use the second of their timeouts as they'll stop the clock with 12 <laughs> seconds to go in the football game. Back to back good plays have them on the move on first down. Flushed out right. They'll let this go for the end zone. And he's in for the touchdown. Oh, and God. in the final seconds, final second. forget overtime. They just likely won this thing in regulation. Ooh. Might be seeing that one on the highlight shows tonight. The home run ball here in the fourth quarter to take the lead. There's nothing like being aggressive, preaching that to your team, and then following through. All oh. the way through. Go ahead and throw one more My up receivers. there. Why not? Been a great game, and we are not done yet. Well, we were on hand for a fun and entertaining a game one. here. Coming down really to that last play. Great job defensively to get the pick and seal it. And we know that every play during a game matters. You're never sure which one's going to be one of the key ones. But at the end of the game, when you analyze it, three, four, five plays are going to be the ones you focus on. And that last play was one of them. The last shot had to take it. And they came up with the interception oh, and sealed the their victory. Yeah, a little bit better than you thought. So for the Raiders, they remain one of the hottest teams out there as the wind moves them to oh, six and one. Get and they out will head back. Oh, frustrated running back. Explosiveness, that's what he needs. All right. 
what does JJ Watt want to say? Hmm. Thank you, JJ. Well, next week it could be Matthew Staff is sending a text. Or, let's see. Oh, no one. Hmm, that's interesting. But I'm going to leave this here. And if you guys liked it, smash that like button. I'll see you guys in the next one. See you later, guys.